You're so ugly! <gasps> You're so ugly! Um, yeah. Santa baby, slip all legs under the tree. Good morning, guys. What are you doing? I'm coming back to life. <laughs> coming back to life? I kind of tried, but it didn't really work out. Like this morning, I really couldn't be bothered to do my makeup. It's one of those mornings where you just are like, no, no. Like, you know when you, like, so I've been doing my makeup every single day almost for like 10 days now. And today I'm like, I, I just don't see it happening. Well, actually, we are running late for breakfast. I don't know how we slept in so long. Probably because we didn't set up alarm. We're gonna take some pictures this morning and then we're gonna figure out what we're gonna do with Because the outside, it's snowing so much and it snowed whole night. You cannot see a thing. Can you see the snow? Like, basically, imagine big mountains there that you cannot see now. So, it's completely, completely snowed up. Um... We need to pack actually today, which might be a bit of a problem um, since we left already a lot of mess. We need to pack and leave today, which is very sad because this is just so, so, so beautiful. Even though it's snowy, it's so stunning. This hotel is such a beautiful place to be at, so we're very sad to leave, but... I am still gonna try and do a little bit of makeup even though I'm I'm so lazy to do so but I need to be presentable for the pictures and for vlogging even though you guys are the sweetest audience ever saying that I look better without makeup but I'm not quite convinced anyway um, I'm wearing something I wore recently as well the Fendi trousers and the white knit just because I haven't had a picture of it so I want to shoot it and then I might actually change for the other parts of the day. I decided to become a little bit more presentable, so I have done a tiny bit of makeup. Like, how long did it take me to do this makeup, Dosha? Five minutes. I think less. I think two. Five. Five? Okay, let's agree on three and a half. Four. That's still closer to five than two is. 3.7. That's still not fair. Like, and normally you're so bad at negotiating, so why are you now being such a pro? Anyway, we're gonna eat breakfast. What are you gonna have? I don't know, maybe some fruits or something. Some fruits, like, okay. Yeah. Um, go and check Dushan's video to see what kind of apple he found this morning. Also, I've never seen anything like this in my life. And I've been to a fair share of mountains, but like, how are we gonna drive today? The kind of stuff we do when we wanna take a good picture. I'm just tidying up the setup because uh, we finished the picture taking process. You can see it on my Instagram. I genuinely do want to sit here um, and just, I don't know, there's something so magical about it. So we are now in this little kind of like, um, I guess, library lounge area and it's so cozy that we never want to leave. Okay, it's time to pack. Uh, my suitcase and everything is here. Also, there's some of the different stuff here. I don't really have that much stuff, or it doesn't seem like it. Probably everything else is out. But I'm just gonna figure out in what I'm gonna travel today because I already shot this look and also spent a whole day in it recently. So I wanna wear something else. I'm gonna figure out what. And then we're gonna pack all of this crazy mess and gonna leave. <music> We are all ready, but Dushan's doing some work, which is not, um, he's not able to postpone, and I hate waiting. Like, one thing that I hate doing the most, that was like the first thing that I told Christina um, on our Hong Kong trip, I hate waiting. Like, I don't even, I, like, I don't know, I hate waiting even for traffic lights. So, um, I'm gonna entertain myself for the next few minutes, because, like I said, did I tell you that I hate waiting? It's not that waiting is anybody's favorite hobby, however. I'm just a little bit like, when it comes to work, I like to use the time super efficiently. And for me, sitting around is like such a waste of time. So I came to check out the spot. So you've seen my outfit and it's very clear that I'm not gonna be swimming. 
for sure, but I just wanted to show it to you guys. So this is the pool at the Severance Hotel in um, Lech. And it's so relaxing, it's so warm in here and so beautiful. I really love it. And I want to see what is this whole area like. Well, actually, I feel like a bit of water. These are the changing rooms. I'm not gonna obviously film in there. This is the stairs. Okay. And this is the gym. Wow. I actually love this gym. It's very modern and very, very, like, there's not like too much to do, but for example, that's one of my favorite machines over here, as you guys know. And then you have everything you need pretty much for shoulders, glutes, like the overhead press is here, the press, like high pull, low pull, and I think we got here the leg glute, yeah, leg curler extension core, amazing. You pretty much got everything. I love, by the way, these um, treadmills because on them you can watch like Netflix, YouTube, everything on that little screen over there. So it's very, very modern and fancy. Now the only thing that I can do is hope that in these five minutes Dushan has finished his work so that we can leave because I've already prepared the vlog for tonight. I do the day for day, so each day I prepare like the description box and everything, so it's ready. I'm packed and in the coat, so ready, ready, ready. Okay guys, we are now en route to Stangelwert. I think it's in Tyrol. Um, it's two hours away. The snow, we're the only people on the road except from the machine that cleans the snow. I don't know what it's called in English. Gertalza. <laughs> is <laughs> in Bosnian, <laughs> not in Serbian. In Serbian it's Gertalica. In Bosnia and it's Gertalca. Uh, no shade. I'm from Bosnia, kind of, technically, so, you know. I have um, a lot of friends in Bosnia. Yeah, so no shade. You're a really good driver, but you're also a very good complainer. <laughs> so. Well, the best of both worlds. Yeah, exactly. You're the best of both. Isn't that just amazing? Jack Frost nipping at your nose. So I'm offering the sample phrase. for you guys like a second ago but I didn't know that the camera was zoomed in I will insert it now Ne piče engleski Okay we're gonna try šta ti treba Nešto veganski skroz Tire se kaže životinja I'm gonna try my best German Ovo ti je Kjeza je sir A ovo je špek to ti šunka that was it for my German. So sorry, Dad. You paid for so many German lessons. <laughs> Didn't work. Pero hablo español muy bien. Yo soy tu madre. Few hours later, we arrived here. Who remembers this from two nights ago? Hopefully, this time. It's gonna be the right hotel. Actually, we decided to go without suitcases, as you can see Dushan over there. Um, because last time we came with all the luggages and suitcases and everything, and we were like, hi, we came to check in. And then guess what? It was the wrong hotel, so hopefully now it's gonna be right. But we are first gonna check in and then gonna bring bags because we learned, we learned. So I have to say, it's so beautiful in here. Good to have you here. Very happy to be here. I hope you had a good journey. Yeah, it was, it was like, snowing today. Oh my god, I'm so happy about that. <laughs> Do you want to have a glass of sparkling wine or some orange juice, some coffee? Or? Actually, I think Do we're good. Hello. Hi. It's fine. <laughs> oh, yeah. Wow, this is, oh my god, it's so huge, our room. Oh my god. Oh, but look at the fireplace. <gasps> this is so nice. Wow. And the balcony. Oh my god. 
Ladies and gentlemen, we made it to Stangelbert Biohotel finally, which we are both very happy about because, like I said, we already arrived here once by mistake. So, I'm gonna give you a tour of our beautiful room. This is like the walk in wardrobe that honestly is huge. Like, I'm sure it's bigger than most people's wardrobes at home. Like, it's so big. Maybe even bigger than mine. I don't know. Then, over here is the main like area there's a bit of like a living eating space here we already managed to create some mess in like one minute there it's is your bags. a little panel where you can like kind of adjust lights temperature sauna and everything else that you might need then over here we have some snacks oh my god i'm so excited for this are you hungry yes i'm sorry i bet mm. and then some chocolate and raspberries and champagne we sadly never actually finish our champagne because we don't really drink that much, but it's so generous and kind. So over here, we have a huge terrace. Like, you probably can't see it today, but we'll try to show it to you tomorrow during the daylight because I think it's beautiful. This is where we can be editing. It's so cool. Obviously the bed. And ta-da! Dushan's favorite fireplace so that he can light fire. There's some wood and some firecrackers. Okay guys, one thing I didn't show you is our bathroom. I think these are our bags. Yes. Hello, Hello. come in. Thank you so much. The bags are here. Now, I'm gonna take you to the bathroom, which is incredible. We have actually a toilet over there, which is just a toilet, but here is a bathroom. Here is the incredible bathtub. Then we have two sinks. Lushan and I both said how amazing it is to have two sinks because it just makes life easier. Then a beautiful shower and my favorite, which is sauna. I love using sauna by the way, and it's so good for your for having like beautiful skin. Whenever I go to sauna in my gym, I make sure to give myself like a nice face massage. So that really helps always. But that's my room tour, and I'll see you later. Bye. And guys, small update. We are now heading to the hotel restaurant for dinner. Our first dinner here. Um, very excited actually. Are you hungry? Uh, yes. Always I'm hungry. not too hungry because I stopped for that pastry that I ate. However, I might have a little tiny bit of food, like some vegetables or something healthy. By the way. Let's all to eat something I'm hungry. I know, but I just wanted to show them my um, knit with like teddy bear. Do some things is very funny. It's a Ralph Lauren knit that arrived on the day that we left to Austria. Came in post and I love it so much. It has a hoodie as well. It's so cute. I'll try and find the link to link it below. One more thing I wanted to tell you is that everybody is so friendly in this and in the previous hotel we stayed at that whenever we run into people in the corridors or in the restaurants or anywhere they always say hi. And I love that. That's kind of how my nephew is as well. He says hi to everybody and anybody. And I just love how pure and kind that is. Like completely opposite to like big city life. So yeah, this is what I'm wearing. Off to dinner now. Okay, family Kalinic arrived. Dushane. What? what? You are now a proud member of family Kalinic. How does that I'm make so you feel? <laughs> you anyway know that like uh, my parents and my sister completely adopted you. Yeah, they already and, told that to me. You know how I always told you I love healthy food and this is why I love this menu so much because it's like healthy but fun. There's like crayfish salad which I love, minestrone soup, like spinach dumplings, yummy. Um, what else do I love so much? Roasted sea bass with ratatouille vegetables and homemade gnocchi. Like, oh my god, I'm gonna have that for sure. There's also something that sounds amazing and that would be eggplant telegio lasagne. Oh my god. Honestly. Oh, there's also something for you, Dushane. Pasta with tomato sauce. That's on the children's menu though, but if the shoe fits. Merry Christmas. And this is how good my dish was. It was sea bass with gnocchi and it was honestly one of the best dishes I've had like in a long time. No, but this is like the second time we have the same drama, this vlogmas. Dushan, I'm not gonna walk all the way back. Can you walk? Okay, let's go together then. Hi there. 
Basically, guys, this is our room. We walked all the way, and apparently Dushan didn't bring the key. But you always bring no, the key. You said it. Oh, here's the key. And I was like, okay. No, you and asked, like, oh, where's the, the key? The room. No, and you asked, where's the key? And I said, it's there. Oh, here's the key. Yeah. I, I'm not gonna take it. You take it. Come from the other side of the room. Take the key. I cannot believe it. <laughs> I was like... I was 100% sure, sure you're going to take because you asked where is it and I said it's there. Why would I take it? Jordan feels kind of stressed so he wants, uh, he says that hugging helps the... No, you said it then. But actually you were so bad at hugging when we met, you hated hugs. I'm also not bad at hugging. But you're better. Well, I'm working on it. Are you going to light our fire? I don't know what's happening with my You're English. so good. <laughs> Can you light the fire? Of course, my darling. I'm so excited. Mm. And I just can't hide please it. Please stop singing, please. Okay. Please, thank okay. you. I had to change my sweater. And I told Dushan this completely doesn't fit with my concept of like my vlogmas because I normally have one outfit that I am in. <sighs> What are you doing now? So basically I told Dushan like, I'm not gonna change the sweater for your video because he's planning on doing some uh, never have I ever challenge in his video as part of his vlog, today's vlog. So go and check it out if you speak Serbian. Um, uh, and now he's setting the light and I probably look so idiotic. Great, but at least I changed my sweater for him. No, you look fine. I changed my sweater for him and now we're gonna do the video. I have like zero material for today's vlog and um, that is because it was kind of a tough day. I basically like, I had to do a lot of organization for projects that I'm doing like in the second part of December. And you guys don't really get to see most of that stuff, but it's quite like sometimes stressful. Sometimes working with people, other people can get very difficult because, okay, I'm a very organized and very structured person but not everybody is. For me, everything should be in writing, everything should be very clear, and everybody's job needs to be like specified, like who's doing what. I think that's the key to successful business, to in general like successful projects, relationships, and everything. I think communication um, should be on a very high level. I'm not like ranting, I'm just kind of stating what kind of personality I am when it comes to work. Yeah, kill me with the light. Um, so today was quite a challenging day. I also had like some family, things like um, going on and really like had to dedicate my time to that. So I'm very sorry that I didn't manage to vlog much until now, but I will try and fix that if I can, still. So fire is burning. I'm gonna go and have a shower now in here. But before I do that in here, I'm gonna ask Dushan a few questions. I have two questions for you. Okay. One question. Shoot. First question is, what do you love the most about me? You're a hard worker. I mean, yeah, yes, but I didn't right. know that's what you love about me. I thought you loved that I'm so beautiful. <laughs> okay. Uh, you're a hard worker. Uh, the, the second is that you're always organized. Thank you. Mm, you're... You motivate me a lot. Mm -hmm. Thank you. And That's you're enough. going on my nerves every day. No, no, I didn't ask you. Every that. day. Can I tell all you? All the time. And you're uh, uh, two nice things, two bad things. Guys, she like switch moods. Five minutes happy, five minutes angry, five minutes... Uh, oh, I need to work. We don't work a lot. Then happy like... Hey, 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 let, I want to rest. Jump on you. Crazy, so crazy cute. girl, crazy girl. So, uh, the, this woman. morning, this I'm morning. I'm proud of it. Okay. This morning we woke up and I was like, Like, good morning, you're a superstar. And she was like, I have a lot of work. And no, like, immediately like I was that. like, okay, I'm gonna be No, sad but also. this morning was kind of justified. You know what happened. I don't know what means justified. No, <laughs> no. Uh -huh. Let me tell you two things I love about you. 
I know. I didn't ask you, but okay. I'm gonna tell you. Thing number one is that you have like a really good heart, like a big heart. Like you don't have one bad bone inside of you. Like you don't have anything bad about you. You don't even even people that like stole from you, you don't want bad for them. And other thing is that you always are open to like um, working hard and becoming better. And I think you will be like such a big superstar. I mean, you're already like really successful, but I think you I'm will kidding. do so well because you, you are so you. determined a lot and so motivated to make it. Now yeah. bad things. Okay, shoot. Um, you are so flammable. What? Like if I say, oh, your like something is so ugly, you would be like, what do you mean like, why? Or if I like, even give you like a little bit of like some criticism and it's not in the right moment, you get so angry. But when it's not in the right moment. So I have to be so political about it. So you, you know, like, uh, you're so fun. Wait, and I need to tell something about that. I, I think you would get, get in a fight in a club. Like if someone tells you something bad about like your sister or mother, I think you would yeah, like kill yes, yes. So flammable. Yeah. And I got the, like, yeah. so, like a lot if of fighting. Someone tell you something about Tammy. But me. this morning, I was taking pictures of her and we were like in such a rush. And then she started to take pictures of me. And I was like so insecure. We were like in a rush and she was like, <laughs> wait, okay, this is your phone. You were taking pictures of me. We were in a rush and you were like, you're so ugly! <gasps> You're so ugly! And I was like, what the f but you were so that, that was not the right moment to tell no, me no, that. No, 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 you okay, were fine. no, I'm ugly. No, you're not ugly. In the pictures you were so ugly. But it was my fault. I said I'm not doing the right angle. I even said, wait, I need to try a different angle because- Because you're so ugly from every angle! <laughs> No. That was the definition of the wrong moment. Okay, next. Um, the next thing that I don't like about you is that you have bad communication skills. <laughs> yes. So I don't like that about me. So for example, all it takes to reduce so much pressure is to communicate better. Like if you tell me, hey, today I cannot take any pictures of you because I have this, this, this and that going on, I would be like, fine. But if you don't tell me, but I'm expecting, obviously this never happened because you can always take pictures of me. And <sighs> so, no, really, you never said no. But like, you know, you need to communicate better your things to other people as well, but you never want to disappoint. This kind of comes from the fact that you have such a good heart. So you never want to disappoint anybody and you want to do everything, but you cannot. Well, I want to everybody And you have happy. to understand yeah, that you cannot make everybody happy and you just make them angrier and it will cost you friends. This costs usually makes you cost friends, if that made any sense. Yes. But that's it! Anyway guys, um, thank you so much for watching today's video. I really tried to make it eventful and to document every moment of today, but it was not very an eventful day, we just drove, packed, ate, and that's it. So I guess some days are just like that, but you know, you sometimes just have to arrive to places. So tomorrow will be much more fun, and the day after tomorrow, because we are not traveling anywhere, so that will be way, way, way better. Thank you for watching, even on a boring day, and I'll see you tomorrow, same place, same time. Bye, guys!